Welcome to a narc-free new year where I am going to read you excerpts out of my book, Healing from Narcissistic Abuse. Recover from empathy deficient relationships and emotionally unavailable people. If you want the link to buy this book, I will have information at the very end of the video. So watch to the end or just look in the links down below. Let's get on with today's excerpt from the book. Chapter two, page 42, trained to give yourself away. Systematically through childhood training, you learn to give your power away to a supposed greater cause, which is the narcissist's cause, because they cast fear and self-doubt on your boundaries. They know you have a conscience and they play into that, trying to use it against you. So when you try to lay down boundaries, you hear things like, you're being too hard, too difficult, too untrusting, too unforgiving. It's all about how you're the bad person. When in reality, you're the only one with a conscience. They lack a conscience because they see it as weakness to be exploited by supposed smarter people like themselves. This is how and why they try to get you to relinquish your boundaries while they relentlessly maintain theirs. Learned helplessness. These repeated situations create learned helplessness and hopelessness for many codependents. You were brought up in a situation where nothing you did worked. Confrontation, encouragement, prayer, reasoning, understanding, you name it, nothing changed the outcome. Why? Because the narcissist is hell bent on getting their way and getting their wishes fulfilled at the expense of others. The cost of a relationship with a narcissist? Well, mentally, it costs your confidence, sanity, self-esteem. Physically, it costs you energy, health, safety. Psychologically, it costs you with anxiety, depression, fear. Sexually, it costs you pleasure, relationship, trust. Socially, it costs you networking opportunities, your reputation, having a support system. Spiritually, it costs you losing your soul, maybe, and your sense of self, your mind, will, and emotions. This is how you learn helplessness and hopelessness. You lose yourself in these relationships where it becomes all about them, their drama, their desires, the car they want, the house they want, the career they want, the marriage or the partner they want, the lifestyle they want at your expense. And you're never the priority. You never get to win unless it in some way benefits them You'll never win with a narcissist because remember, the narcissist knows what's best for everyone. So they get to decide, not you. Or at least that's what they drill into your head with their continual autocratic decision making. And this is how you learn that resistance is futile and to just relinquish your power. You learn to give it away to people because you come to believe that there is no other choice if you want to make a relationship work. Not only does a narcissist believe that what they desire is more important than what you desire, but they also believe that their pain is more important than yours. And that's why you get to fix and sacrifice for them, not the other way around. If you're interested in purchasing this book, Healing from Narcissistic Abuse, Recover from Empathy Deficient Relationships and Emotionally Unavailable People, remember it is on Kindle ebook version. You can get it on audiobook at Audible, and you can also get it in print at Amazon.com. And for those of you who like to sit back and watch and listen, well, I've got the video version over at my Etsy shop. Links for all of these are going to be found down below. And if you want to watch the next video available on narcissism, click here. Thank you all for your support.